Hello Gemini, thank you for stopping by my channel. I hope that this week went well for you, that you are happy, well, and deserving. A lot of blessing in your life there. So today I'm going to look into the message for you uh, for this coming week. And so it will cover the Valentine message as well, hopefully. And please take in what resonates and did the rest. Shall we look into <coughs> The message together here. So the first card we got the solutions. Ah, okay. So this is the angel calling upon the solution number fourteen. So um, it's telling you here, Gemini says success is coming from objective compromise. Of course, you are you are going to compromise, right? So success is coming from objective compromise. So, you know, you need to also have a self-control and patience as well. If you uh, <clears throat> don't have patience, then you need to slow down. So all the blessing will come to you when you wait and when you have self-control and be patient. The good thing will come into your life and your blessing as well. So making sure that if you're holding grudge against anyone, you need to um, give a forgiving and healing energy so th this is not just for them okay this is for you as well this is actually for you so you can have the sense of lifted no burden no heavy hearted within yourself okay so um, if you can just be patient and look for the success that coming from the um, objective compromise and, and moving forward in your life journey it will be success for you here so, all right, so let's take a look at two, <coughs> the next card here. We also have a page of Ariel here. So this is page of Pentacle. Yeah. Ah. So this is um, uh, abundance and maybe job opportunity, money, um, perhaps job with a good uh, promotion coming your way. So these energies of a uh, reliable, a clever, Perhaps you are educated, you are balanced. Perhaps you, um, you know, receive some kind of scholarship going back to school to earn more knowledge for yourself. So the message telling you here that this is an excellent opportunity will be offered to you. Yes, absolutely. Job, money, um, opportunities and um, business growing, you know, things like that. And so... <clears throat> is surely coming your way on so um the message also kind of pointing to like a song scholarship maybe you um accept the job they uh telling you that you know you can take this opportunity and going back to school this is a scholarship they'll pay for you to go and earn extra knowledge uh, for yourself so perhaps that is what offering to you as well you know scholarship for education for continue learnings things like that so also this is how a uh, message telling you say hey Gemini this is time for you to go to work and make uh, good things happen you know earn your money earn your position and be um, be reliable worker as well let's take a look into the next card this is um king of raphael huh this is king of raphael this is king of cup right so um this is the um when you look at look at the uh king of cup here you can see this person is a masculine who have lots of love lots of respect lots of knowledge and lots of um you know uh uh a well-known respected as well as you look into this card here the king of cup here you can see a lot of emotion with the water right i mean so much love so much emotion it's big compared to um like a big um ocean you know lots of water lots of love lots of emotion behind here you can see the um the kings are protected and blessed by an angel and behind an angel there's a glow and almost like a dawn in the morning 
it's simplified to me. It's like um, I can see that as a success, a newborn, new birth, new opportunity, right? Anything would come with the sunshine. It's bright. It's a blessing. It's um, you know, um, uh, successful to me. So this is King. Have that opportunity. Have that energy. Perhaps this is your energy here, Gemini's. Okay. So as you look to into the water, look at how much waters are splashing with the whole bunch of love from this king. I mean, and not just that you see these two fish here hop up from the water with a joyful and cheerfulness. This is simplified or perhaps the also energies of love itself. Okay, these two right here. So the message is telling you here, say yes, yes, this person can be trusted. They could be your um, love of your life that coming in or perhaps the person at your work that you look up as a mentor or someone in your family. It could be even your dad or uncle or grandpa or whatever that may be. It's telling you here, Gemini, say, yeah, yes, 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 this person can be trusted and this person will offer a lot of love, a lot of mentor, okay? So it is safe to trust this person, okay? So this is the ability to accomplish many things at once, see? You know, most of the time we want to take one thing at a time, but yes, that the king, energies of the king is the same thing. But, you know, you have the ability to uh, accomplish many things at once, you know, in your life. Not at the one time. I don't see like one time. I mean, how could you, um, you know, grab, hold on to a lot of things at once to focusing on that energy, right? So now you make sure you follow your creative passion and put your passion into work and this person maybe be your mentor, give you lots of love, nurturing and mentoring, okay? So that could be that energy as well. Or perhaps this is you <clears throat> giving it to someone else, perhaps you the one that received this um, abundant message and abundant blessing yourself, okay? Oh, well, I can see here that uh, um, uh, energies of... Uh, calling um, for you to repent uh, whatever that uh, does not go well Gemini's that uh, energy telling you say hey you need to let go this root this foundation and this idea um, period it is not working for you now so you know take a hold of yourself and change the direction of what you are doing right now because what you are doing right now, the spirit looking down from the heavens say, oh no, Gemini, you are going the wrong way. For so long, I am going to rescue you with um, offering, um, helping, and a peace as well. Okay, so I understood that sometime though, that you are going to make a change. And, you know, sometimes it's hard because you live your own life in your own pattern for so long. It's difficult to make a change, right? But an angel coming down say change it because the the plan that you put into work right now is not even serve you well. That's not even moving an inch. It does not go anywhere. So go ahead and make a change, okay? I mean, if the plan does not go well for you already, what can you lose? Nothing, right? But the new beginning, new start. The new beginning, new start give you a chance and opportunity for you to grow, for you to be success. Please take that advice. Oh my goodness. The next card, see look, it's the magician. See, after you um, making a change, there's a new, the new manifestation, the new magician. Not just this magician. You know, you can manifest anything in your life, Gemini. You can see this magician being this powerful stick point up to the mountain and earth here. So this is connection between the earth and the mountain. See the finger down, go down to an earth here with a whole bunch of white flower and red flower, simplify of uh, passion and compassion and love here, right? So remember that uh, magician here, hold on to four elements, the love, the cup, the water, and the pentacle, the money, the job, and the one is a uh, creativity, you know, put things into work, perspective, 
and the sword is all the idea all the um, work on the power that you are going to have here you simply can manifest and ask for it because magician anything is just like a magic things can appear within your fingertip things can appear within your blinks of your eyes okay so there's a good energy here you know get rid of the own pattern here you are magician look at that magician oh my goodness here another card here so coming for you it's the sun you know the sunshine is always a uh, simplify of the new birth the new born new beginning the new happiness you know leave away the own pattern the own thought you know new day is a new beginning now it's a it's a birth you know every time you see the sun looking down to this um the white pony the white horse with the children riding on this um on a white horse here you know simplify to me the red is more like a victory to me like you know you become a child again you know birth newborn again right you have that new opportunity again but not just the new birth newborn and new beginning sun way here look at all the blooming sunflower it's blooming yeah yeah your new beginning is going to bloom and bright and shy and pretty and give the blossom just like this sun sunflower here okay all right so let's look into more of the message from the spirit here okay and look at that okay well huh we are we have a king of cup again you have two king of cup by the way one is over here and one's over there yes the love the nurturing like a father figure the person that you can trust this is um you know this is the person that may be mentoring you, person that uh, you look up to. Could be your, your love person that coming into your life, or your family member, the mentor, your grandpa and grandma, your dad as well. Okay, This person has ability to accomplish many things at once. So many, many blessings with this <coughs> king of uh, cups here. You know, follow your creative passion, things will happen for you. Um, so you can see the flow of the energies of love and emotion as well behind the king um, seating right there. Okay, so you have two power of the king of cup. So this is telling you big thing here that you need to really trust this person to guide you to your pathway, whatever that you are working on. This doesn't work here because once you do that, you have a magician. You can manifest anything. And the, and the newborn, new birth from the sun there. Okay, so see what we have here. Oh, look at that, the wheel, see, look. After you get rid of this own pattern here, you have so much going on for you. You have the wheel, so things are moving forward for you. Things that you are waiting for is come to an end. You can see the light at the end of the tunnel now. Perhaps you move to a new location you know, change your job to the new city, even the, even the country, even the state. So the waiting for you is a no longer waiting. It's ended now. You can move forward. Also, it's telling you here, Gemini, if you are struggling with something, the wheels are keep moving forward, right? So you, your struggling will never stop there as long as you're working towards that. All of your suffering, sorrow, and challenging will end for you okay you have a good energy with the wheel of um, fortune here the wheels keep going or perhaps maybe you buy the new vehicle right yeah wheels vehicle perhaps you travel the world travel the places for your work here look at this you have uh, energies of eight of pentacle here you've been working really hard you really focus on your craft your job and your opportunity in um, so you can grow your pentacle of success here you even leave behind people in the city you come outside and you're focusing on building your your growth your abundance here to number eight so you really really going to um, be success keep going and keep doing keep put your craft into work keep show your ability even at work even you are a business owner all of those hard work is going to grow you abundant financially okay so let's look into a card from here look at that we have a 
the world. Everything come to, you know, come to um, an end for your waiting. You are ready. You are blessed. Your success. You are going to go out there and lead your life in the world successfully. You know, this is a blessing for you to go out. Look at the wheels and the world and the hard work. You have magician and the sun and lots of mentor, two of them. So, yeah, look, leading you to the the new uh, the new direction of your pathway here yeah, leave this own belief um, system behind oh oh whoopsie oh wow look at this you have an ace of pentacle offering look at this money and money perhaps you know perhaps after you're working hard look at all of the blessing coming from the hand of the device um, coming through the cloud here you know the sun ray coming look at beautiful uh, passion and love here with a white flower here with the gate, you see the gate, if you see the pathway, the gate walk into the abundant, the gate of success there. So it's coming, okay? This is coming with the beautiful sun as well, with the beautiful offer of the abundant, with the money, job, promotion. This is the gate that you just need to walk through to the gate there. If you come, come to closer, the gate of the abundant, abundance is coming your way. Wow, I am so impressed. All right, so let's look into the um, the card of uh, Oracle card here. You have the uh, impasses that reflect and direct your energy. Yeah, so you know what? Yeah, that's what the energy calling for you to do here. Reflect on your goal is if it doesn't work, redirect it, you know? You have the opportunity to change any time. There is no uh, and no minute someone can tell you it's too late. No, you know, you need to reflect on your your goal, your ability uh, of your foundations and your uh, direction. If it doesn't work, redirect your way, okay? Take on upon the, uh, the, new, the new goal, the new pattern, I mean, you know, um, you have that ability to do so. You can stop and reassess any time. I don't feel like in life is anything is too late unless we go on to heaven. And while we're still on earth, you can always choose it. I believe so. Choosing your path. See, redirect, reflect. Choosing your path on is possible for you. Never too late. Mm -hmm. If this path does not go well, you can choose a different path on possible okay for you take that for advice from the spirit let's take a look for one more oracle card here yeah step into the power yeah so if you need to you know go within walk even through the night use the, the light uh, in the light to shine within you thinking and manifesting prayer and ask and see what answer do you need, what direction that you need to go to. Because when you go within and step into your own power, you are in control. You can have on the answer all of the uh, 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 direction where you need to step into. Okay, whether you realize or not, you are stronger beyond the measurement, beyond you even give yourself a credit for. Yeah, most of the time, you know, people just run to friends or family saying, you know, help me, what do you think my plan is? Go within and you know well, and you know what to do. You're stronger, you're smarter, and you have ability to come up with your answer and your, um, to solve your challenging here, okay? All right, so I don't see, let's see, do we have any love coming for you here? Beside the love of the king of uh, cup here, you have two energy. I don't see any love for your uh, Valentine message. Let's take a look into that together, a message from your person, shall we? Oh, oops, one, one, two, want to come out. All right, so let's take this two for now, ego. I let my pride get into the way of our connection. Yeah, some people do. They have so much pride, so much ego. They don't want to lower themselves down. You know what? Sometimes that can cause uh, love, the connection to go sour. 
but they at least they recognizing it, right? They they let their pride get into the connection of your love there. The next one here, the third party, um, there were other things that got in the way of our being together. There could be um, a work, a person is really focusing on the money, on the financial, okay? So they work, work, work. Um, even though they love you, they have you in the back of their mind, they're thinking about you all the time, but you know, this money here that they want, that material thing here, uh, look like they, you know, they put that above you, obviously, you know, but maybe they're in a financial bind that they really need to stretch out their financial, making sure they're taken care of before they come see you, right? They could go either way because this is their message. They say third party is not necessarily a person, could be a work or, you know, a, a project that keep them from being connected with you. And uh, maybe they have a lot in their mind as well. Okay, so let's take a look into one more of the card. Reveal, I want to tell you the truth, see. They want to tell you the truth, whatever that may be in their chest that they have for you there. Um, they want to tell you, they want to share with you. If someone share with you about their truth about themselves, that means they trust you pretty much. Okay, so let's look into the detachment. I had to let this go so I could clear my mind, see. They have a lot of things in their mind. Could be a lot of work, financial. Maybe they own their own business, and they have so much um, going on in at their workplace. So, I mean, you know, that happened too. I mean, we all have that obligation, right? Okay. So let's look into um, a message from the Angel of Abundance here. Ha! Huh, gratitude list, Gemini. The spirit asking you, you have the gratitude list. When you call your blessing and feel your gratitude for whatever the coming your way that, that you already have, you constantly let the universe and spirit know your gratitude for something, a lot of things in a positive way. Guess what? The positive thought, positive manifestation, positive gratitude list will expand and the universe and spirit will bless you even more because when you say so the God the universe spirit and angel can hear you okay so all of those are positive gratitude lists in turn be your blessing and you will receive it okay so that is the reading for you for this coming week my beautiful Gemini and uh, I hope that you uh, uh, resonate with this message that I just um, get up from the, <coughs> the spirit. If you like the video that I just um, show with you your message, please click like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. That way I can, you know, have my um, channel grow and someone else can see my message as well before you. Um, uh, before then, I wish you all the happiness and healthy and blessed. Take care.